A little bit of paint. It makes me happy. And some music. <laughs> This is the artistic process for Zach and his twin, Connor. I like doing it because this makes me happy. The 23-year-olds have a genetic condition called Fragile X, as well as autism. When we got their diagnosis, um, we were told by the geneticists that they would never do anything in life. Like, we should put them in an institution because they wouldn't walk or talk. In the years since their diagnosis, there's more understanding about their condition, and they found that painting, with each canvas representing a song, is a great outlet. The behavior issues start when they're really young, and they don't have a way to express um, how they're feeling. And he found a way with the music to sort of incorporate it with the painting, and so that satisfied a couple of his sensory needs, so when he gets really frustrated, he asks if he can paint. These paintings, they're now a way to give back to those in the cold. We're gonna get some money to the homeless people. It's that they don't have a home to go to. The inspiration came from a scary situation. One week ago, Zach ran away. I didn't have a hat, old mittens. Hiding in this park in minus 27 weather. By about half an hour, I was getting really worried and ready to call the police. And when he came in, he was so cold. Now the next day came a reminder that the story could have had a drastically different ending. Edmonton police found the body of a man they believe froze to death. This had a profound impact on Zach. They need a home to go to. They need to go to, they need a place to get, keep warm and so. 50 paintings with half of the too. proceeds yeah. or $50 each going to Humans of Edmonton Experience. It's kind of nice to give them back the money to keep them nice and warm. Each twin has a different painting style and sometimes musical inspiration. Connor right now is a fan of Queen. I like it. And Zach, well, as his t-shirt shows, he's been painting a lot of Ariana Grande. I did it. Because the whole music really makes me happy. But the real gift is the joy painting brings to this family. And they're sharing their story to further understanding of fragile X syndrome and maybe help others. In Edmonton, Carly Robinson, City News.